Hey guys, welcome back to the Small Town Craze podcast. I am one third of the Small Town Craze. My name is Mo. Okay. Guys, we are here for another review, movie review. Uh, this one, Amazon Prime release, uh, Roadhouse, directed by Doug Lyman. Lyman. I, I'm sticking with Lyman as well. Lyman. Is that a Lyman? Cash was Lyman. Here, he'll, he'll correct us. He would correct us, uh, like Villeneuve, Villeneuve, and all of that. But um, yeah, this is a movie starring Jake Hall. Uh, I think Jessica Williams, I believe. Jessica Williams. Yeah, Jessica Williams. Daniele Melchior. Conor McGregor's in this. Mm. Uh, <laughs> Billy Magnuson is in this. Uh, a few other people as well. But, um, yeah, obviously this is a remake of the 1980s classic. Um, Done by Patrick Swayze. Yeah. You seen the original? No. Why would I have seen the original? Because you were born in, like, Prohibition era. Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> cool. No, um, I don't know. Maybe you've seen it. Like, actually, no, I f- actually I, I, may, I may have. I don't know. No, I, haven't I can't seen remember. It either, I can't remember. To be fair, but I mean, this is a remake. It's not yeah, a sequel yeah, yeah. or anything. So it is what it is. But we don't have anything to compare this to. Ah. And I know a lot of people kind of really like that one. They kind of consider it. Well, this one. The, the, the pre- oh, one. okay, okay. They kind of excuse me. They kind of consider it a classic yeah. and whatnot. But um, yeah, um, Jake Gyllenhaal has kind of taken the role of the main protagonist, protagonist yeah. in this movie. But um, we'll start off non-spoiler quickly. Cam. What did you think of this Amazon Prime movie, Roadhouse? Again, if I went into the movie mm-hmm. with the, the sort of mindset of just having fun with it, which I kind of did, um, it's a it's a good watch. You got great, you got decent fight scenes, um, a, a lot gory than I thought it was going to be, a lot like bloodier. Um, again, it tells it, it it sort of tells a story of. Um, the Jake Gyllenhaal being not a failed MMA boxer, he's a, he's I don't know he's he's a troubled MMA boxer fighter. Um, had issues before, and based on his previous fight, it sort of put him down a death a downward spiral in regards to, in regards to his life, and he needs something to sort of bring him back up because he was on the brink. Um, and Roadhouse was a project that he I think he took on to better himself and sort of find himself and within that project he found a family and that family being Aww. the road stop I'm not going to do another the way you no but the way I'm you've broken do this down I'm not going to do another non spoiler please keep no, going no, no, please no. keep going I'm so well, sorry well he fights people okay and then no he punches people in the face and that's it yeah, yeah, yeah that's my non spoiler but it was a good watch it was a good watch it's not a good movie but it's a good watch you brought the Vin Diesel out on you, man. Huh? You brought the Vin Wait, Diesel out on you. Family. <laughs> Family. <laughs> um, yeah, for me, I ain't gonna lie, man. Um, I, I felt the way you felt about Kong. Mm-hmm. I know this is not a great movie, but I, but I enjoyed the hell out of it for some yeah. reason. I don't know what it is. And yeah. you might hate me for saying this, right? But Ken Ken, shout out Ken Ken reviews. Bus stop. Shout out Ken Ken because it's, it's hashtag bus stop film. But he feels the same way I do about this as well because I watched his review and I also agree with it. Mm-hmm. This should have been a, a cinema release. This should have been a cinema uh, release. Bro, as you say, all of the sorry, sorry, give me a second. As you would say, yuck. 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 But. With all of the action scenes that were in it and stuff like that, you don't, you can't tell me this wouldn't have been no. the all of the shots of like the big, the water and all of that stuff, the boat no. chases and no. things like that. I think this should have been a cinema release. Personally, it would have been. They would have lost money putting in the cinemas. They would have lost money putting in the cinemas. A lot of movies lose money putting in the cinemas. This like, should, is what it is. No, hey, listen, this. Was, no, actually, no, it wouldn't. It wouldn't have. It wouldn't have. Why? It's Jake because it's because because it's a remake first of all of a classic. It's Jake Gyllenhaal and it's got Conor McGregor, so you're gonna get these f- random MMA fans. Oh that are no come no to. The, the, the the first wave, yeah, you are. But then once people go in and start giving their review like what we're doing, yeah, people are gonna be deterred. But I think it'll at least break even. No, no, I hope you don't. No. But um, no, that's the yeah, yeah, no, no, that's, <laughs> that's I, I, so take, I take I take it back because again, there there were parts of it I enjoyed. <laughs> there were parts of it I enjoyed. No, again, look, yeah, man, Roadhouse. A lot of action. A lot of action. What did you think of his camera styles? Like he did this a lot of like it was a lot of moving in it while yeah, the fights were going on yeah. and stuff like that. Again, I, I could have like, pre- this disorient you. What do you think? At some points, I felt dizzy. At some points, I it felt was dizzy. a lot. Yeah, it was dizzying. But again, look, 
it isn't what it is because I didn't I, I didn't take this movie serious. Right. Not in like serious, just have fun with it. I did take this movie serious from where when we started and uh, could we do non spoilers, please? <laughs> this, is, this is non spoilers. Okay, I mean spoilers. <laughs> Who this he lost man? his mind. Yeah, you it's know. bad, man. Oh my god. Um, I just quickly, yeah. I mean, <sighs> performances of everyone was fine, almost except for a couple of people, like the villain, the main pro, uh, antagonist. Was uh, Conor McGregor the main villain, or was it? Or was he's kind of like the final boss, but I don't think he's the main villain. Okay, if that okay. makes sense. Yeah. I would say the main villain is obviously the the, the, boy, the yeah. bratty yeah, yeah. kid and stuff like that. Whose father we didn't meet, did we? No. He but they just, kept on talking about him. Yeah, referring to him. So there might be another Roadhouse too. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> but the kid, um, he was... Um, I feel like they tried to make him intimidating maybe, but he wasn't a, even a little bit. Like no. I didn't wasn't afraid for Dalton at all. But Conor McGregor, physicality-wise... I guess because I know he's an incredible striker yeah. in MMA. Physicality wise, I'm like, yo, this guy's a threat. Mm-hmm. And he has this intensity where it's like, oh my God, he does look angry. But the acting is just. It was the worst I've seen. This is. It's this not is, the worst I've seen. This, I is room, this is room level performance. This is the room oh, level. Oh, no, performance. stop. It was. Stop, the guy, stop. The guy is, is like, like, he comes in. Yeah, exactly. Sandwiches. <laughs> And it, and then obviously you've got a scene, you've got a terminator scene where he's naked, he walks around like this, oh, and, yeah. it, and he and he eyes up the guys and look at the clothes, and he's oh my god! <laughs> and he walked away, winning the Puna with the with the blazer only. <laughs> this guy, man, you listen. I wouldn't I, look. I say all this now, but I wouldn't dare to say it in front of his face because I know he would weigh me in. Oh no, his left hand is quick. His left sharp. hand is fast, in, in, yeah. in the movie, sharp. Yeah, yeah. I see yeah. go. Whap, whap, whap. Yeah, few, yeah. I was like, okay. I enjoyed the fight scenes more than anything else. But I mean, yeah. because I was looking at it in the light of MMA. That's the IP yeah. appeal, isn't it? Because yeah. I was like, all right, cool. And then it, to be fair to Jake, you know, he done his work, like his physicality. He looked great. He looked amazing. He looked great, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like, he what, am- I checked it yesterday. I think he's like 40 something years yeah, old. Yeah, he looked he amazing. Looked great, man. Yeah. And to be fair, even some of the strikes that he was throwing, yeah. you could you could, you could, could forgive people to think that, Red, like, did he actually mm. do any MMA? Because he was throwing some actual good Qualify, I would say good technical sort of bang. My wife actually asked me, Is he actually a fighter? I was like, No, he's just an actor. Nah, <laughs> he's just an actor. Nah, it, it, was, it, was, it was decent. It was decent, man. Can I ask you a question? Yeah. Because I think, okay, guys, we're in the spoiler territory mm-hmm. now and we're going to get into spoilers properly, whatever. But like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell so you know when the videos are coming out. But quick question, Kevin. Yeah. Yeah. They had the fighting, which looked great. Mm-hmm. I didn't like the whole, there's like a digital aspect to it where, like, the punches yeah, are hitting yeah, the face yeah, yeah. and you can kind of see a little digital edit yeah, yeah, yeah. which fair someone, enough someone, if you're yeah. like we reviewed Monkey Man recently you yeah. don't have that issue there, no not right? at all not at all but you have that issue here but in terms of choreography I feel like everything looked pretty okay yeah. um, but then you go to like the scene where there's the UFC part of mm-hmm. it why does the fighting look like that there because and then it looks like that here it just looks so overly fake in yeah. the octagon yeah. And then in the actual like bar fights and things like that, I'm like, okay, cool. M- maybe could have been contra- contra- contractual. That maybe he was bo- coming up to a fight and there's certain things in their contract that they couldn't do or what have you, mm. or the other way around that yeah. they want to get struck. Because again, a lot, of, a lot of the strikes in here was, um, uh, some of them was really good. Some of them was like, really? Yeah. Did, did yeah. That, yeah. Did, I, did I hit yeah, him? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And he, yeah, even when he was on the ground and he was getting stomped out, it's like some of it's like almost like fake stomp, <laughs> visible fake stomp. Like, <laughs> uh, uh. <laughs> and I was like, oh yeah. But saying that, yeah, I think my problem, looking back, my problem with this movie, that ev- the whole, the whole, the whole sort of cusp yeah. of the, the 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 movie was all centered around the MMA fighting, them two fighting. And that was the only entertainment. Yeah. The rest of it was it's maybe, whatever. Yeah, yeah. Because I, I had a problem. I was like, okay, you're, you're you're booking this guy for this job, and you're keeping away all this. Okay, fair enough. You you don't want to tell him everything. Yeah. Yeah. But then now he's not. People are trying to kill him on the stuff like that. You at least owe him telling him what what they're doing. And at some point, yes. I thought, I think 
they done a distrust. The movie was so sort of like it didn't explain itself in, well enough because I was thinking, is she selling drugs as right, well? Right, 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 right. Did you ever feel, feel feel that? I didn't feel like that, but it was so predictable that I thought, okay, yeah, she's hiding something. Obviously, yeah, that, yeah, that. But then, what she was hiding wasn't big enough. Yeah, because yet you're still a victim of it. But now I thought you was hiding what you're what you're protecting yeah. the place from. It was just, yeah, it was a bit, oh, they want to turn this place into... So why can't you tell him that? These swanky, beautiful... Di- yeah, why can't you stream it? Why, why, you why can't you? <laughs> I'm actually deep in it now. Why can't you just say that? Yeah. Huh. He, 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 going back to the fight, even the beginning. when he I guess the... why, you can't tell him that because uh, you want to actually make him work here thinking there's no... Because she makes it seem like these guys have just come here to cause trouble, and they're just like they're just these guys, but really it's these guys plus this whole, but yeah, organization okay. behind them. But you have to understand. Look at the situation. He's turned up off the back of a fight, being stabbed. Yeah, yeah, and clearly he's on a downward spiral. Yeah. So he, the mere fact that he turned up, yeah. It's like this is a miracle. <laughs> yeah, like this, this guy's already like he was close to he's close to gone. So. Yeah. Like what? What you? What you protecting him from yeah, something? You're yeah. not protecting him. Yeah. He's here to do a job, and then now he's teaching people how to be first class bangers. Like just step back and bank. Like this just sort of, like. Yeah, that was another thing. It was like no one's gonna learn that quickly how to evade a knife and attack. Even someone. a punch. Yeah. Like he's, he's gonna lunge at you. Just step back and just punch. Step, just like that's you, just you know normal. the crazy thing. Obviously, knowing that obviously you've got belts over here. Knowing that you've you've done you've. You're right there. Knowing that you've done boxing before, you understand. Just the myth, you 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 could understand what you need to do, mm. but going through the motion is completely oh, different. different yeah. Especially when there's punches coming at it you. It's different. Yeah. Like if you're going, if you duck it, going like going through a punch, going under a punch, it's completely different. And to learn that in the space of five minutes, one one conversation, no, no, just step back and let it go, and then go through. Just throw it. like I was like, yeah, man, pacing was terrible. Man. I wanted to move to finish, man. It felt too long. How long was it? It was two hours, I think. Yeah, it was two hours. It felt way too long. It yeah. needed to be an hour. Hour yeah. 20 tops. Tops. See, because I, I had that popcorn loving you, no, you feeling was, about it. No, you I was, didn't feel that. Because you was eating the popcorn, you was going through the motion. Well, I mean, I wasn't, popcorn, but you know what I mean? If the popcorn finished at an hour, would you think, oh, I, 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 get. <laughs> I get what you're saying. But no, I, like I said, I just felt like this This way, like the same way you did about Godzilla. But um, what do you think of the alligator scene? Uh, Florida's a scary place. It's a scary place. Oh, my God. It's a swamp. Yeah, it's a big swamp. It's a big Bro, swamp. Bro, like, and he lives on that boat. I swear they can just jump on there, no? They I can't? Mean, I'm, I'm not taking a chance to know. I'm not taking a chance to find out, bro. Because I've seen alligators on land in videos. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, it's just, it, yeah, man. I had more issues. Or crocodiles. I had more issues with the fact that he borrowed the guy's speedboat and then did bring him back. The ex-boyfriend speed, but I had more issues with that than the crocodile killing the bear. Because what annoyed me, this guy, he beat Jake Gyllenhaal who beat you up, yeah. took you to the hospital to yeah. put you on the mend, and you want to come back to try and shoot him. Yeah, yeah. And then, it's just don't it's make brave, isn't it? It's not even brave. It's stupid, bro. It's pretty stupid. It's stupid. And then these guys were victims. Victims. All of the henchmen. Yeah, they were yeah. victims. Even that young boy, he's just he, like he just talked too much. See the one on the on the boat at the um, you know, before he blew up the other little boat. Th- that the made the me boat, laugh. He's like, he's like, he's like <laughs> that made and me laugh. Like, it's like not. It's that bang was just. <laughs> I was like, like, oh, you know when you say, "Oh, bless you." Yeah. Bless yeah. You, man. Poor you baby. Tried, you tried. Poor baby. Because he was so vexed in the face, and he's like. He's like, yeah, and he banged him, and he's like, mm. and he looked. <laughs> <laughs> he thought he did something. He thought he did something, and he looked at him as 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 a grown person, as a man, as a woman. Yeah, you would have to reevaluate. Like, I I think life of crime is not for you. <laughs> Being that bad guy is not for you. Be a, be a protagonist. Yeah, go yeah, go to school, yeah, learn yeah. how to be a good guy, yeah, and come yeah, back yeah, again. Yeah. And his demeanor is yeah. almost like he's like. Yeah, he's like. <laughs> Correct me if I'm wrong. He made the sound as well, right? I think so. In my mind, he, he did. did. Yeah, in my mind. The guy did. banged him, and it was just like almost like there was not. It was non-existent. Oh, that was hilarious. That was the only that bit. Yeah, I was thinking. For for five <laughs> minutes, I was thinking this this kid should not. 
Like, he's not even like a nephew or somebody <laughs> being brought into life because of nepotism or yeah, whatever yeah. it is. It's, like, he was hired. Yeah. Even the boss was like, I'm going to let him deal with you. And you could see his face like, I don't know if I can do this. He was hired. He was hired. So bro. on what pre- on, on what on, on what was the merits? Like, he's going roughing people up. No, is man. this what he does? He blew up the boat as well. And then while his ears were, he tried to come at him. He just... <laughs> me. He just tucked him in quick. Okay, what bothered me now, yeah, was the, the police, the G, the chief. Oh the, my he is despicable, bro. He me. deserved that. He needed to get wallowed, man. The double, double cross, double cross. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it was so stupid. It was man. stupid, but then now, oh yeah, well, we've actually got your daughter. Yeah. Oh. Oh, come on, man. And then obviously now the daughter is the love interest of the. And that was developed so weirdly as well. Bad. That part. Yeah, was that bad, was pretty man. bad. Oh, but that, that that area that they went to was pretty nice, you know. Yeah. That so was, that's so uh, was, they were in water and it was just it was so low, shallow, and they could just chill. That was and beautiful. there was just water all around there. There's no shore. That was amazing. Yeah, I like that. I like that. That was beautiful. But man. the alligator were coming. But, was but it? would you go there? <laughs> <laughs> no, but at least it's so shallow. I could see it at least covered. No, but no, but the alligator. You you would, you would still do that. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it was cool. It was, it was, it's not. Yeah. It was not nice, man. It was not a good movie, bro. And the thing about it, like the action scenes, if the ac- these action scenes were in another movie, yeah, it would have been decent. Yeah, and it was almost like there was it was violence overload, man. Like I told it you, was, I watched I watched that and Monkey Man the same day. Monkey Man must have been a relief for you. Which one did you yeah. watch first? I watched this first. Okay, good. So it was like a palate cleanser, but not a palate cleanser in yeah, a way. Yeah, but yeah. it was like, but the violence overload was a lot already anyway. But in this one, that last scene that he had with Conor McGregor to fight, and then he survived. Jeez, well, man, man. Louise, and he just like stab, 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 yeah, stab, yeah. stab, 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 stab. I was like, this looks cool, but woof. Yeah, I was thinking, I was thinking, from MMA, from fighting to this, mm. it just seems like a, a the transition just didn't work. It didn't didn't need this. Yeah. Also, do you feel like they were trying to purposely be corny? Because you know. <laughs> You know when he's they're fighting, he's punching him on the piano. Yeah, and he's like, I don't think this piano is true. He's like, I think it's, I think it's, <laughs> I think it sounds fine or something like that. I was like, are these the corny? I was like, you're not doing this on purpose now. It's bad, man. The one liners. I think they was trying to sort of pay homage to sort of like the. The 80s type the 80s of style. Type stuff, yeah. yeah, the one liners and everything. Because Conor McGregor was a one liner. He was just full with those one liners, bro, bro. When he turned up. And he's eating the sandwiches or whatever, and the other big guy was yeah. just like something, something, bucko. I'm like, you don't speak like that. No one's the black guy. You know? Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. And I was like, who do, you, who do you think you are, bucko? These guys are victims, like, bro. These what's guys happening are victims. here? So this guy jumped in a Ferrari. The whole trans, the, the transit of him getting from where he was, a naked man, to there. Why? Can you, can you explain, please? I don't know. I think he stole all those clothes as well. All the clothes and all the cars and yeah. everything, and he got there. He dresses how he dresses in real life in that. When he goes to a sunny spot. It's crazy, man. And he <laughs> he crashed the student driver car. That was kind of funny. He didn't give a crap. <laughs> those injuries at the end, how do you survive them? Which ones? Him? Oh, uh, Dalton, you mean? Jake Gyllenhaal? No. Conor McGregor well, didn't die. He did die. He did die. I'm the one who leaves this cinema early. What? <laughs> don't tell me there's a post credit. There's a post credit. He didn't die. Oh, don't lie. He didn't die. I turned it off. He he came out. He came out the um. He came out. He he escaped the thing in in his in robes, and you see his bum, the whole naked thing from behind. The, the hospital. Yeah. Are you kidding me? You're lying, Kim. Please check up and let me know. Bro. Are you are you I'm trolling me right serious. now? I'm dead serious. I'm dead serious, man. I could talk to the mic while you look at. It. That's how bad it is. Please do, it, bro. It, it, this this movie was so bad, man. Seriously, I don't know why they did that. But he got stabbed like 16, 11 times. Sixty eleven times. Sixty eleven times everywhere in his neck, in his head, everything. And the and the thing as well, like even when the guy crashed the boat, and you see when he flew into the. the oh, he should have at least broke sign. Something. Sign, bro. Like it just didn't. It just didn't feel like it meant any. Oh, you see it. You see it. It didn't feel like it meant anything. Any of these injuries didn't mean anything long term. It's almost like it's almost like a cartoon that they could just get up and go go again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It happened. It happened. 
You might see that Red House too. That is a bit too ridiculous. <laughs> he got he got drunk up in his neck and everything, and like yeah, it's crazy. Red House two. Two two two. Okay. They might they might do it in um, where was this one done? Florida. Might do it in um, California. 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 Yeah. Yeah, it makes sense. Makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> We should have done Ricky Stanicki. Um, I promise you we should have. I promise you we should have. If you ain't seen it, go watch Ricky Stanicki Prime Video as well. You know what I mean? They're both Prime Video movies. But, the, um, th- those those songs, those those cover oh, songs. So I, I, I genuinely went into this movie so I'm just going to watch it because you recommend us. Yeah. So I'm just going to watch it. It's funny. I have... I had so much fun. Bro, anything he's in now, John Cena, I'm looking I have to, I have to watch it. I, yeah, have to watch yeah. it. I don't care. Because I know I'm not taking it serious. Right. But he can be good. And you got to rate Zac Efron for taking a role like that too. He just came with Iron Claw. Yeah. Like that. Like, you know what I realised? I'm doing it. Zac Efron is not that big of a person. Very oh, muscular. Not, yeah. But he's not big. Because John Cena is massive. Ma- yeah. Massive. He's yeah, not big yeah. at all. <laughs> yeah. But anyways, uh, you got anything else you want to say? No. We have to rate this, sir. Uh, yeah, we gotta do that. You know what? Yeah, go ahead. I'll start. I'm giving go it. On. I'm giving it like a five. I'm a five is for me in my mind. Five is average because yeah. it's in the middle. I'm giving it a five. I'll give it a four point five. Yeah, it's yeah. better than the, the other ones. I, I, I told you, bro. Four point five because I was uh, like I enjoyed so because how far fetched it was. I was like, <laughs> how dare you? The audacity. Yeah, man. <laughs> How dare you, man? Go for it, man. Just do it. Bro, these people are guitar and playing and these people are getting beat up in front of them and the music is getting even harder and everything. And then... Like, <laughs> At one point, the whole bar was empty because they fought out to the outside. Yeah. They're still playing music. It's crazy, man. Oh, man. But yeah, guys, that was our review to Roadhouse 2024. The Amazon Prime video movie uh, starring Jake Gyllenhaal and Conor McGregor. Um, yeah, I don't know. Like, Let us know in the comments what you guys think of this movie. Uh, let us know in the comments if you feel like this should have been a cinema release or not. I'm really curious to know because me and like someone like Ken Ken, we believe the same thing. Ken obviously doesn't. I wish Hashi was here to let us know as well. I don't. I think Hashi would have agreed with mm. you. But yeah, we'll see. But um, yeah, guys, like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell so you know when the videos are coming out and we'll be back for more reviews. Peace. Peace.